Yes, umbilical cord stem cells are uh, essentially aspiration of these cells is easy because uh, there's no pain, there's no procedure, there's no surgical uh, procedure involved. Uh, another advantage of these stem cells is that uh, genetically and uh, in the HLA type as it's called, uh, the possibility of using these stem cells is not just for the newborn but also has a very good chance of compatibility with siblings of that child and uh, a better chance of compatibility with the child's parents as well as compared to adult stem cells which uh, the possibility of finding a genetic match in the general population is obviously going to be far less. So somewhere hemopoietic stem cells from umbilical cord tend to be uh, more useful not just for the child but for the entire family. Uh, on the concept of stem cell uh, therapy and the use of stem cells in human medicine, I am fully convinced. I have been uh, an active proponent of uh, stem cell banking and cord blood banking right from the time it began in this country. Uh, we have banked uh, numerous, numerous patient samples. Uh, as a concept, uh, there is really no denying the fact that it will, it has the possibility rather of changing human medicine completely. Uh, for the skeptics, uh, there is enough data now, there is enough uh, available statistics from not just India or around the world. Closer home, even in our own city, even in our metro cities, there's a lot of smaller institutes which have started using these samples of cord blood and, uh, you know, stem cells that have been banked for therapy. So, uh, gone are the days when it was a futuristic concept. It's very much here, it's very much happening and it's all around us. Now, the advantages we've already gone over that uh, this is a painless procedure. This is a sample which would otherwise be discarded. So, I see really no downside in banking this. Uh, as regards increasing the uh, availability of banking services, I think to a certain extent with more banks, with more awareness, with better technology, the costs would come down eventually. And if the cost came down, we could just reach out to more and more couples and families. Uh, as regards to maybe any particular uh, person thinking about whether I should bank or not, I don't see any reason why you shouldn't. And I would just say that if the facility is available, if you are aware and uh, there are enough people who have counselled you about the concept, you would also agree that there is really no harm, there can only be benefits and there can be benefits for many years to come, not just for you but for the children. So you should definitely bank as soon as you are convinced of the concept.